Hello everyone. Welcome to yet another tutorial on statistics by Simply Learn. Today, we'll discuss a very important rule in statistics that is empirical rule. Before we move ahead, if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, hit that subscribe button to never miss an update. So, let's discuss the agenda for today's tutorial. We will start this tutorial by discussing what is empirical rule and we'll see the graphical representation of the empirical rule. Then We'll work on an example to understand the empirical rule more comprehensively. So let's move ahead. What is empirical rule? The empirical rule, which is also known as the 68-95-99.7 rule, states that 68% of the data occurs within the one standard deviation of the mean and 95% of the data occurs within the two standard deviation of the mean. Similarly, the three standard deviations covers 99.7% of the total data. Suppose we have a bell shaped distribution with mean value 50 and standard deviation 5. We want to answer the following questions. Since the mean is 50, one standard deviation to the right will be 55, two standard deviation will be 60 and three standard deviation will be 65. In a similar manner, one standard deviation from the left will be 45, two standard deviation will be 40 and three standard deviation will be 35. Since 50 represents the mean value, all the values below 50 will cover the 50% of the total data. The value 40 and 60 are within two standard deviations of the mean, which covers 95% of the total data. The value 50 and 55 represent exactly 34% of the total data and greater than 55 represents 16% of the total data. Consider the following example. The marks in science of a group of students follow a normal distribution with a mean value of 70 and standard deviation of 4. We want to find the range around the mean that includes 95% of the grades. So let's first note down the important data. We are given a mean value of 70 and standard deviation of 4. So from the previous slide, we know that the 95% of the data means the two standard deviation on either of the sides of the mean. We'll add and subtract the standard two standard deviations that is 2 into 4 from 70 on the either side which will give us the value of 62 and 78 respectively. This means that 95% of the total grades lies between the mark 62 and 78. So with this we have come to an end to this tutorial. Thank you all for watching this session. We hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, feel free to put them in the comment section of this video. Thank you again and happy learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.